welcome dear students today in this practical we are going to perform the practical on this drop and film wise condensation apparatus the aim of this practical is to find out the convective heat transfer coefficient in two phase heat transfer phenomena here we are generating a steam and that steam gets condensed in this chamber and we can visualize the drop wise and film wise condensation phenomena as well as we are going to calculate the value of convective heat transfer coefficient the theory which is used to analyze this experimental apparatus is the drop wise and film wise condensation now after discussions of the aim and objective we are going to analyze the apparatus arrangement given for this practical In this apparatus we have one heater chamber over here in which we fill the water and then we start the heater which is rated of 3 kilowatt and then after certain period of time we have the steam formation and that steam is transferred to the condensation chamber using the stop valve same way for the condensation we require the cooling media and here we are using the water as a cooling media we have one tank in which we fill the cooling waters which is circulated in both the types of the condensation elements here we have two different condensation elements one is plated with chromium and another is made of the copper and here we have the two different valve which can circulate the cooling water in the condenser elements here we have the rotometers which measure the flow rate of cooling water we are using four different pt 100 types of the thermocouple for measurement of and temperature one is fitted over here second and third is fitted on the condenser elements and fourth and fifth one is over here which is measure the cooling water inlet temperature and cooling water outlet temperatures then over here we have the uh, pid controller which can protect the overheating of this elements for the safety purposes so this is all about the apparatus arrangement this is the charging valve from where we need to supply the water this is the pid controller safety protection device here we have the pressure gauge which indicates Here we have pressure gauge which measures the pressure of steam inside the heater. Here there is a drain valve is there. Then from this main steam pipe, the steam is supplied to the condenser elements through the steam stop valve. Then steam is going over here inside the chamber, and then steam is condensed on these both the elements. Now we are going to analyze the cooling water supply. and it's arrangement so here we have the cooling water chamber this is a cooling water circulation pump which supplies the water from this pipe and then it comes from this pipe in between we have this rotometer which is measure the water flow rate from this two valve we can take any one of the elements in line for the condensations then for the measurement of temperature we have this three sensor temperature sensor one this is two and third one is measure the temperature of steam inside the chamber second is measure the temperature of condensed element which is plated by chromium and third is for measurement of the condensed elements which is made of copper fourth pt 100 sensors we have fitted over here to measure the cooling water inlet temperature and fifth one for measurement of cooling water temperature at outlet over here so this is the overall arrangements are given in this apparatus
now we are going to operate this experimental apparatus and then we will wait till the steady state conditions are reached and then we are taking the observations in our observation table. After calculations of convective heat transfer coefficient by practical as well as the theoretical value, we need to compare it and student you need to write your conclusion. Thank you. Thank you for attending this practical session.